up wedding nerdigans this is the one and only packer girl 89 and today's manga nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for kingdom chapter 522 and last chapter oh yeah it was molten time last chapter and we got to see him fight against pate anyway let's get to this chapter and see what happens next osin sama it would seem our real left wing has begun their attack za right wing kisui army uh hq kisui sama the enemy's second wave those 5,000 cavalry are almost upon us. Kisui-sama, the enemy forces behind them have come into view too. What? What the? There are two groups? Didn't, uh, but didn't our men say it was one mass of troops? They've simply split themselves into two armies, huh? What? Then, is that... They mean to strike us successfully in a number of waves, a uh, wave attack. Upon these encroaching waves of terror, hints of despair began squirming in. Oh no, and this is called the left wing's despair. I, I, uh oh, this does not sound good. This doesn't sound good. I'm scared that the le I'm scared for Moten. He better not die. The Mako army's uh, second wave meet the meets their foe. Ka wa kia kua. Kia! Sh shit! Ga! Whoa, already? What is going on? Ki it's so. It's no use. The formation's a mess. Makosama, the second wave has entered the enemy ranks without issues. Hmm. So this is the famous Kisui army of Kokuyu? I had placed some um, measure of expectation upon them. But it would seem that when uh, placed against us, even they are not worth mentioning. To think that our second wave would overwhelm them in such one sided manner. Ga! Ah! Brother! It's all, it is all thanks to the bait. The Gakuka unit, sir? Aye. <laughs> to be honest, even I had not expected the Gakuka uh, to toy with the famous Kisui army to such a degree. I had taken him to be all talk. Uh, you know, Moten's for re Moten is for real. He ain't all talk. Uh, but it would seem that the pro um, prodigal uh, heir of the Mo family has the skills to back up his words. Yes, he does. Oh, now we're going to need to see the plan. As the bait to distract the enemy until our left wing's main army arrives, we shall fulfill our duty. I hope you under understand the importance of your upcoming uh, role, Moten of the Gakuka unit. For we, the Mako army, have the honor of boasting the greatest offensive power in all of General Osin's uh, uh, re retinue. And in what shape or form we have um, uh, come cr uh, crashing down upon Zhao's right, right wing will all come down to your performance. <laughs> well, even assuming that you did screw up your job. It is impossible that our left wing shall be bested by Zhao Trash. Eh, my lord? Um, perhaps, eh, my lord, perhaps you would deign to share one of your esteemed strategies or two with this cocksure youngster who ha was uh, blessed by his birth. That will not be necessary. What? You have my guarantee that the Gakuku unit um, will, uh, through our own methods, uh, set up the enemy forces to be susceptible to the Mako um, army's wave attack. How did you know that my men will be utilizing a wave attack? Because Moten is genius, yo. <laughs> we will prepare the best possible stage for you uh, to make your appearance. From then on, it shall uh, be up to you uh, to you and yours to make it a grand performance, General Mako. But Terry and we shall be the ones uh, to steal the show, foo foo foo. God, how are there so many? Just, just how big of an army did they bring? Ah, yeah, huh. That these Zhao soldiers were suddenly struck by um, a hither or two, uh, by a hither uh, to unseen army, as uh, unseen enemy, caused them to believe that the kin had arrived in greater numbers in actuality. <laughs> and compounding this issue was the addition of the Mako army's um, second wave of 5,000 cavalry, uh, resulting in the Kisui army reeling from an onslaught that felt as if the kin, num kin numbers had swollen to, ten uh, tens, to thousands, tens of thousands of soldiers. Together, this cultivated in a tremendous drop in morale amongst the men of Riggin. But even that did not mark the end of uh, their trials, for there was still the third and fourth waves to come. If Kisui's armies were led to um, their vulnerable flanks, um, or to let their vulnerable flanks remain open to these two fierce attacks, then this uh, arena located on the side of the whole battleground oh, excuse me, would be as good as lost to, uh, to the Zhao. <laughs> However, Kisui, commander of the Zhao side, was not about to idly sit by and let that happen. Immediately dispatched Rogeki's 1,000 cavalry out, out from our left flank. 
have them ignore the areas that um, have broken out in melee and instead engage in the upcoming uh, thir third wave from their front left. Do not recall that 10,000 that were sent to aid battle until they have regrouped with him. Once regrouped, have Batay take command of them and likewise have them hit the incoming third wave, but this time on their right flank. Kisui-sama, do you mean to salvage the situation? Of course, I don't know if Kisui can because I think this is all going according to Moten's plan and maybe even going according to Osun's plan. Then we should move our HQ towards the rear. We must fall back and reestablish a battle line. Right now we're bearing the full brunt of the enemy's assault. Out of the question. In the time we spend withdrawing, how much ground do you think those third and fourth waves will cover? We will, rem we will remain at this position. Um, send word to all units that they are uh, to stand their ground and defend their HQ to their dying breasts. Yes, sir. Have the men to um, our rear push forward to the front while letting loose the war cries of uh, Riggan as loudly as they can. Yes, sir. Also, pass along that the enemy is uh, less than as a number. Um, less, my nor less, ugh, less, my lord? You have all fallen hook, line, and sinker for Osun's uh, ploy. Well, first impressions may lead you to think we have been hit by a massive army, but the kin's are forces have are made up of four blocks of 5,000 each. In other words, a total of 20,000 men against the 30,000 of our forces. Ah. Uh. Even the initial 5,000, uh, including the initial 5,000, they still only have 25,000. We outnumber them by 5,000. Uh, I don't know. They, you might outnumber them by 5,000, or I don't know if you've counted the dead yet. <laughs> it is precisely because they fear our numbers that Osin has sought to close the gap using these tricks. When it comes to pure manpower, we have the upper hand. So long as we are able to stop their current momentum, then with our advantage in numbers and the quality of Riggan soldiers, our victory is all but assured. It is time for us to turn the tables upon the men of Riggan. Ooh. Kisui's speech just now contained just one lie amongst a myriad of truths. I knew it! I knew the motherfucker was lying! <laughs> I knew it was lying! He was bluffing! Um, the Gakuka unit's um, initial ambush and the first two waves of the Mako's army already had in fact... Um, offense had in fact already slain several thousand South soldiers, meaning that by this point their numbers were evenly matched. I fucking knew it! I knew it! I knew Kisui was, was lying. Of course, Kisui was fully aware of this fact while making his rallying cry. Is something the matter, my lord? However, in the chaotic field where the situation remained fluid, the truth was there was an entity that Kisui felt to be an even greater threat than the Macau army at this point. The entity was lying to Kisui's right. Moten, the Gakuka unit. Yeah, no one fucks with Moten. Moten is just a beast, man. Damn it all. We couldn't take out uh, Bate. It was the perfect chance, too. Can't be helped. Zhao sent close to 10,000 soldiers, soldiers to save him. What kind of man must he be for them to dispatch a whole 10,000 men? Kisui's main army seems to be under attack by Macau's forces. What is our next move, Moten-sama? The fact that Bate is making for the front means that Zhao uh, HQ remains functional and they just, um, that they intend to stop the second wave, uh, second half of their wave attack. Wave attack, sir? And Mikhail was going to hurry his um, 20,000 men from his location at the center to here. He would have split them into smaller chunks. To um, have them stay separated during the attack would be the better play. It would appear that Kisui is, the Kisui army is somehow managing to weather Mikhail's assault. But it, it's, it's not very well, though. In other words, events are unfolding exactly how General Osun envisioned they would. Oh, Osun! He's... Osun is... I'm telling you, he is the Mars god... Oh, it, uh, the Mars troll of war. A, a, um, the Roman god of war troll of war. He just totally is, okay? Like, this is just something very calculated that Mars would do. What? Kisui HQ. There is a risk that the initial 5,000 to our right may attempt a pincer maneuver, but weren't they nothing more than bait? Only it's there to serve as um, a distraction until the bulk of their forces arrived? 5,000 is uh, too many for something that serves uh, purely as a decoy. Our current situation demands that we direct the entirety of our resources towards enduring the wave attack. Like, I keep thinking there's going to be a water Pokemon somewhere in Lashio <laughs> wave attack. <laughs> I know, I'm being stupid right now. And now those 5,000 sol uh, soldiers have um, uh, become capable of roaming wherever they please and are currently hidden on uh, the other side of the those forests. They could simply charge forward right into our flank or loop around to strike us in our rear. Either would be a devastating blow. It is no exaggeration to say that they've become the greatest threat to us right now. Ah. Uh, 
Now that um, the board is like this, the outcome of this battlefield will all come down to the next move of those ne of uh, those 5,000 soldiers. The talent of their commander will be the one thing that greatly uh, shifts the balance one way or another. But looking at what his, move uh, his movements have been thus far, it is clear that their commander is no average tactician. And most concerning of all is the fact that he has come this far and achieved it all with only 5,000 men. Yeah, Moten's a boss. Like, seriously, Moten is awesome. He is one of my favorite characters for a reason <laughs> in this manga. Um, anyway, Kisui Sama then, should, should we um, not hunt down those 5,000 men even if it means? It's no use. Commit those resources and we will simply be battered by the wave attack. K Sorry, I don't know why I'm yawning. Um, I was not able to read their intentions this far ahead. 5,000 men who originally played the role of bait, but now due to our attention being occupied by the sudden arrival of their main army, they have now tra uh, transformed into being the true offense? Kisui-sama, Kisui-sama! However, I fear that this entire development was by no means a coincidence, though it may be hard to believe by placing these 5,000 men on the left wing at the battle start. Osin had env envisioned that the board would develop into this exact scenario before the battle was even joined. What a terrifying eye for strategy. So this is the Supreme Commander of the Kim Forces, General Osa. I mean, General Mars. I'm, Yes, I'm calling him General Mars because he just fucking is. He is just totally Mars. Kim Center Army, Osin HQ. Uh, Macau is engaged, but the Zhao are holding. The moment Osin uh, learned of the left wing, he whispered softly to himself under his breath, so you really did see it. That whisper was directed at Moten's remark. Or Moten's, uh, remark um, me when he was first informed of his position on the left wing. But Terry and we shall be the ones to steal the, sh uh, steal the show. That is to say, at that point, Moten could already see the same development on the board that Osin had envisioned. I suppose we should um, uh, disappear from their sight first, and with our next move, claim the head of the Zhao commander, Kisui. Yes, sir. <gasps> so Moten's going to take out Kisui next chapter? Oh, my God. I'm Moten's going to outshine um, Macau and just fucking just kill Kisui and that's how oh, Moten is going to get promoted. <laughs> yeah, this is this is Moten's time to shine, man. Macau may have done some of the work, but Osa, or, um, Moten's gonna get the kill. I got a feeling. Even, because even um, Kisui says he's scared of Moten and Osin is just proud of him. <laughs> he is. Anyway, let me know your thoughts about this chapter in the comment section below, and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigan Sync. If you love what I'm doing and want to contribute to the Nerdigan Sync expansion, there's a few ways you can do that. You can donate to the Nerdigan Sync PayPal, Patreon, or purchase something off the Nerdigan Sync Amazon wishlist. All those links are in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on the Twits, aka Twitter. Follow my Twitch channel for me on PlayStation Network. All that's in the description box below as well. Until next time, Nerdigans, I'll be seeing you later. Bye!